welcome to Vlogmas Day 10! Now, when I say good morning, I actually mean... <laughs> it's noon. Oops. Um, but I have been working on stuff. First of all, I got my vlog edited. It is rendering, should be uploaded in a couple hours. And I've also been finishing decorating my door. Now there is one part of the door that I forgot to do. So I'm gonna do that right now. And then we're gonna get the final touches on the door and it's gonna be done. And it's looking really good. Now I have always been a creative soul but I have never been the artistic type. So these kinds of things are hard because, you know, I'm creative and I have that like perfectionist tendencies um, when it comes to this, when it comes to these kinds of things. But artistically, like I can't always do what I want to do with it. But honestly, it's looking quite good in my opinion. Uh, I'm really proud of it. So, but like I said, I just have one more thing I need to do um, and then we'll get that on the door and then it'll be completed. <sighs> Finally, this thing's taking me a while to do, but um, just got one last thing to do on this piece of paper. Well, this last part of it wasn't the best, but honestly, I'm just kind of over it at this point. So I'm going to pop this on and we'll be done. <laughs> this is don't feed reindeer and he's covering it up <laughs> so good. They're little like scarves. <laughs> oh, very cute. Very cute. I think it's a good one. All right, email has been sent to the management company and they said the winner will be announced on December 16th, which is this coming Friday. Well, next Friday. Um, so, now that that's finally done, um, I think I'm going to have a little bit of lunch here. Um, and then I think I'm going to head out to the mall, um, do a little Christmas shopping, um, see some festivity stuff, festivity stuff, um, and just kind of enjoy, enjoy an afternoon out, um, and see what we get into because I have my whole afternoon free. Um, I do need to be back this evening to help out with that charity uh, live stream that I was talking about um, in yesterday's vlog. So I do need to be back for that this evening. But I do have my whole afternoon free and it's only 12.20. So like I said, I'm going to have some lunch and get going. I'm not totally sure why I thought coming to the mall on a Saturday right before Christmas was the best idea, but I'm here. Oh my god. This isn't even like one of the main malls in LA. Like this is, this is more like a local mall. I do want to go to the Grove at some point, which for those of you who don't know is one of like the main malls um, out here in LA, but Emily has never been to the Grove before. So I um, wanted to wait and go with her. Um, so she can see it. So I'm kind of just doing some shopping at the local mall, but still they have it very decorated for Christmas, so. There's literally nowhere to park. What am I supposed to do with my car? Oh, this is so annoying. Why did I come to the mall on a Saturday? I should not have done this today. I have the flexibility to come during the week. Why would I do this today? Oh, sometimes I question my intelligence because I was like oh you have Saturday it'll be, it'll be fine it'll be no issues no I literally cannot find a place to park oh here we go I don't think I've 
ever seen traffic this bad before. Like, I, there's literally nowhere to park my car. At all. Like, I don't know. <laughs> I might have to go somewhere else, because... I mean, not like anywhere else is going to be any better today. Oh, I'm so stupid for coming to the mall. I do apologize. I haven't taken you guys anywhere with me. Ew, is, my, ew, is there like a smudge on my camera? Ooh. Anyways, is that any better? Maybe. Anyways, um, I haven't taken you guys in any stores with me because one, I didn't end up going to the mall. So it's not like... I just went to Target and Bed Bath and & Beyond and it's just a lot of stuff everywhere and a lot of people everywhere. Um, so it's not like going to the mall where there's the big Christmas tree and there's Santa and there's coffee stands and all of the festive stuff that I was hoping to do today because I literally could not find a place to park at the mall. Like it was insane. Like even here, so I went to another like... It's like it's kind of like a shopping center, not like a mall. It's just like a bunch of stores, um, one by one by one. But um, I went to another like a Target area, and it's still like so busy here. Like I still had to drive around for about ten minutes to find a place to park. So it's stupid. I don't know why I came out on a Saturday. Um, I might hit up a couple other places over here. I'm not sure. I'm gonna take a little drive around and see what other stores are here. Um, but if not, I think I'm going to go home and I should probably start wrapping because I've got, I did pick up a handful of things today um, and I do have a bag full of stuff that I've gotten um, throughout the past couple weeks. I haven't done any Christmas shopping or um, wrapping yet, so I do need to do that. So um, if I do cut my shopping short, I will definitely go home and wrap some presents because um, I think that'll be fun. But I, I do apologize. It just, it would have been chaos to like have my camera out and trying to vlog and there was nothing like interesting or festive to see it was just angry people like getting angry at each other and shoving and long lines and people getting upset and you know people yelling at each other outside and you know people honking because they're trying to get a place to park and it's just it's chaos it's chaos I love this time of year but also like oh my lord everybody calm down <laughs> that sexy door. Also, what the heck? Yeah. <laughs> right, so I didn't go anywhere else. I did like a drive-by to see what other stores were around. And the only other one that was like, would have been relevant to me was a Toys R Us. But I've already got my nephew and my uh, niece a couple things each. So I didn't really have a need to go in there. Also like, going into a Toys R Us around Christmas is hell. So, but I did, um, so the couple things that I got from my nephew are, I bought online and they're on their way, um, as well as one other thing for my niece. But I also got this for my niece. I'm gonna go ahead and show it to you because, like, obviously she's not gonna watch it. She's two. But I got this, um, it's by Crayola. It's a mess-free touch lights thing. And it comes with like a, you can use your fingers or it comes with like a little crown thing and you can draw on it. Um, and it's like different, you, different colors and also plays music. And I, I feel like I totally had something like this when I was younger that you could like draw on it and then somehow you like wiped across it and it made it like black again and then you could draw on it again. But I, I don't know, I just thought that would be really cool. I actually found it online and then, um like on Target or at Target and um but I didn't I didn't want to have it shipped from Target because I was like I can just go to Target and find it um and you know it's not like Amazon where I have like the one or two day free shipping thing so I was like I, I'm running out of time to do online shopping which by the way I did do a handful of that this morning so I've got stuff on the way um, but, so I found this at Target, and I think my niece will really like this. She's, like I said, she just turned two, 
Um, or she's about to turn two, I guess I should say. Um, her birthday's coming up, and I'm just kind of combining her birthday and Christmas together, just because I'm obviously not there. Um, so it's, uh, it's just more convenient for me to just kind of do birthday gifts and Christmas gifts for her at the same time while I'm home. Um, but anyways, I hope she really likes this because I, like I said, I swear I had something like that when I was younger and I loved it. So, but I think, so I've got a couple bags, hopefully without giving away too much. Um, I've got a couple bags of stuff there. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and start wrapping with my new... That's kind of old paper. I don't know if I'm going to use it, but I've got this new um, Happy Holidays <laughs> dog gift wrapped. Gift wrapped. Gift wrap. Oh my lord. Gift wrap um, that I got from Joanne Fabrics the other day. So I think I'm going to use that. <laughs> oh my lord. I'm a mess. I'm a mess. I'm a mess. I'm a mess, I'm a mess, I'm a mess, I'm a mess, I'm a mighty goodness. What time is it? It's 4.30. Um, it looks, it's like dark and gray out too. Like, I don't know if you can see. Like, what's up with that? Like, it, I don't know why it's so dark. Ooh. Maybe it'll rain. Wouldn't that be nice? So I just went down and checked my mail and noticed that I got my December birch box and you all know how much I love my birch box. So I thought I would open it on camera with you guys, uh, show you what's inside. Um, and then instead of my normal like try everything kind of at once um, video that I usually do with the birch box, uh, I'll kind of review the products throughout the week depending on what they are and when I can use them. Um, and just kind of give you a little update throughout the rest of the weekend and the week of what I think about these products. But first of all, before we start, can we just talk about how absolutely gorgeous the box is this month? Like, it looks like it's tied up. It's got gold with like a pink ribbon here. The box is like a purplish color and it's just so pretty. I love the packaging of Birch Box. I love how each month the box is so pretty like I actually hang on to the boxes I don't uh, normally throw them out um, unless they start like piling up or whatever but this box is just so beautiful anyways let's get to what's inside Ooh. oh so they uh, looks like they gave me little like gift um, tags uh, in case I, I need some, which is kind of cute. I like that. I, I'm guessing this just for random whatever, or maybe maybe they're thinking maybe I'll give some of these away. I'm not sure. Um, and then there's a thing in here. It says, Shine On. It's their normal little card. And this month it says, Hosting get-togethers, dressing up for shindigs, and searching for a million gifts this month. We're here to help you master the holidays and shine your very brightest all December long. This box is filled with brilliant festive products, plus treats for on-the-go touch-ups and easy gifting. Love, Birchbox. Oh, and it looks like their theme is Shine On, because on uh, one of these cards it also says Shine On. Um, so let's take a look at what's inside. So the first thing here, um, it looks like it's by Real Chemistry, and it's a luminous three-minute peel. Ooh, this is what it looks like. And on the back here, it says, where is it? Apply this acid-free peel to clean dry skin for luminous results. Massage in circular motions to exfoliate, then wash skin with a mild cleanser to completely remove. Oh, I love me a good like mask peel. Um, I've been all about those this month. Oh, I'll be very interested to try that. The next thing here is a dry shampoo. Yay! I actually just asked Emily the other day if she had any dry shampoo because I ran out of mine. Um, and I, I don't like washing my hair every day just because it's not good for your hair to do that. And I'm also just lazy, let's be honest. Um, but this is by Death Valley and it's just dry shampoo. Nothing to it. But I'll be, I love dry shampoo so much. So this is a new brand that I obviously haven't used. So I will for sure be using that. Uh, the next thing here is by Hey Honey Walk the Walk, and it's a foot and heel cream. Ooh. Now, Heel Honey, here I'll show you the product here. 
Heel Honey, um, they actually, that's the concealer that I got, um, or the concealer is by the same company, um, that I got in a birch box a while ago that I have been loving. And I've actually been thinking about getting a full size, um, product of that because I really like it. But it's the, like I said, it's the same brand, Hey Honey, um, foot and heel cream. This will be nice. Um, I don't, Sorry if this is like gross and beauty and all of that for those of you who aren't interested, sorry. Um, but I don't take care of my feet the best way or that I always should. You know, a lot of people like moisturize and, you know, exfoliate their feet, you know, every other day. I just don't think to do that, to be completely honest. Um, so maybe this will entice me to, oops, take care of my feet a little bit more. <laughs> Um, this product here by Ipkin, I-P-K-N, Radiant Cream Primer, ooh, uh, with SPF 15. Uh, rich in fruit extracts, this nourishing SPF 15 primer creates a smooth, luminous canvas for makeup with the help of shimmer pearl powder. Ooh, now I, I'm really bad. I don't ever use a primer, which I know, um, really helps with makeup. A lot of the pros use it. It helps really to kind of keep your makeup on and in place. Um, and I never really do that. So, uh, and a lot of primers are kind of expensive. So whenever I get a primer in my birch box, I do, I do use it because, uh, like I said, I don't normally purchase primers. Um, maybe I just haven't found the right one. Maybe Ipkin will be the right one. Um, I don't remember if I held it up, but this is what it looks like. The next product here, oh, I think Emily got this um, a birch box or two ago. It's a blush and bronzer palette by Coastal Scents. And these favorites from the blush and bronzer palette impart a radiant glow. Add a pop color to your cheekbones and sweep the highlighter wherever you want a lifted and defined look. Now, I'm not the best when it comes to contouring, highlighting, and all that. Um, Probably could stand to watch a few more YouTube tutorials on that, um, but lovely. You know, I actually have been using the same blush for a very, very long time, and it's starting to run out. So um, that was a gift from Birchbox to uh, to realize that I needed that. <laughs> now there's one more thing in here, and usually one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, usually you only get five products. I'm not sure what this is, but it says Shine On on the front of it. Um, and it's wrapped up here, and I'm not sure, does it say on here? No, I don't know what this is. I guess we'll find out here, if I can open it. Oh, how lovely! Oh, it's just a little mirror! You can all see yourselves on the camera right there. Oh, very pretty, and it's got a beautiful pattern on the back of it. Um, I believe, yeah, it says Birch Box there at the bottom. I don't know if you can read that, or maybe my camera's focusing. Oh, how lovely. That'll be nice. I'm always, you know, you always need a compact mirror to carry around with you. Oh, thank you, Birch Box. I love their products. Like I said, I'll be trying these. Um, throughout the week and I'll let you guys know what I think of them. All right, most presents are wrapped. There they are. I mean, there's still obviously more to come and I say most um, cause there's two in that bag there that um, I did not wrap. One is kind of hard to wrap so I'm gonna try to figure out another way to wrap it. And the second one, I'm not really sure who I want to give it to. Um, I know that sounds weird that I bought a gift and I don't know who I want to give it to, but, um, it would make, it would make sense if you saw what it was, but, um, I might just, like, give it to the whole family, you know what I mean? Um, and then we can all enjoy it, but, so yeah, so, but I have more gifts coming that I've gotten online, um, from Amazon, and I have a gift coming from another place as well, um, they're just not here yet. Uh, that being said, I'm getting ready to hop on to Twitch. Um, I'm helping a friend of mine on Twitch with a 24-hour stream, uh, like I mentioned earlier, for Extra Life. Um, and I'm just going to be, I'm personally not going to be streaming. I'm just going to be in his channel 
um, kind of just like playing games and kind of helping keep things going. I'm also going to host him. Um, so that way some of my viewers hopefully come over, um, and help him out. But, um, but yeah, I think he's about halfway through the 24 hours. So he's, he's, he's still going strong. I've done a 12 hour stream before, but I've not done a 24 hour stream. So, um, so major props to him for doing that. Anyway, so I'm going to just like run into the restroom real quick and get um, ready for that. I've got a little drinky poo over here in a not Christmas mug. Um, this is some hot buttered rum. And yeah, so I'm going to get ready for that. I'm sleepy. I'm so sleepy. <laughs> oh, if I didn't show you guys what I was wearing today, um, I've got black leggings on because I live in leggings. Now this shirt, um, I got this from H and M. It was on sale for ten dollars, which is freaking incredible. But I love it. It's so cozy. I love the little like um, neck of it. It's just super cozy. Anyway, oh, there's that mascara. Where it is. There's a mascara. Not a spider. Anyways, um, it's late. I'm tired. Um, it's almost 1 a.m., which I know is not that late. I know, I know. But um, but I I've kind of like readjusted my sleep schedule because I was staying up like really late and then sleeping in late, which is not good. Um, because I feel like I waste my whole day if I like sleep in late in the morning. So I've been like up at a pretty decent hour every morning so um, I'm sleepy now but uh, so I'm gonna go wash up and I'm gonna go ahead and get to bed I hope you guys enjoyed this day much love to you all um, I will see you guys in the morning and have a wonderful evening bye